Good morning, Rollins. My name is Kayla Jordan. I'm a senior. I'll be graduating this August. I'm an anthropology major, and I'm currently enrolled in a May master focusing on Central Florida archaeology. So today we're going to be taking you guys with us as we head out to Panther Tracks, which is a 5,000-year-old shell mound. We're going to set up a line that sits above the test unit uh, that's level that we can measure down all the different layers from. So it's going to be the baseline for the whole profile drawing. Oh my god, let me throw it again. Hi, I'm Kelly O'Neill and I'm a graduating senior at Rollins College. For context, these fools are all just sitting there <laughs> watching this interview happen. But you know, we're gonna keep going. <laughs> so, Kelly, what has been your favorite part of the field school? Um, I like when we did surface collection at Heifer Mound. We found a lot of St. John's pottery. Yeah. <laughs> all right, we're gonna have Jane, another graduating Rollins senior, take over the Snapchat for a quick moment. I'll be back. Rollins, this is huge. I think I found some human remains over here. Incredible! <laughs> Look at it! <laughs> Hi, I'm Christina Russell. I'm a senior at Rollins College. I'm an art history major and archaeology minor. So, why did you decide to take the field school? I took it because I wanted field experience for archaeology, and this was a local um, opportunity that I live right next to. And, and I'm also interested in Native American archaeology, and this was what I wanted to cover, so it was in my field of interest. So have we found anything particularly interesting in our test unit? Yes, we found a lightning whelk, which is a large shell that had a bunch of apple snail shells inside, which was used to cook, and it was used to cook and had residue inside from the food, so we might be able to date the pit and the level that it was at. Awesome! That's, yeah, that's been one of our biggest finds so far. Can you explain what this is? Yeah, it's a piece of pre-Columbian pottery. Uh, it's a type called St. John's check stamp, and it's about 1,200 years old. What you doing, Kayla? Yeah. So, we've got a backfill in here. We're going to take, take all the dirt, dirt, dirt here. And push it somewhere else. And put it over there. <laughs> Hey guys, thank you so much for joining us today. We are back from Panther Tracks. Uh, class is over. That was our last day in the field, so thank you for joining us. I hope you enjoy. We will be continuing some projects later on this summer, and I'll be doing some work in the lab, so if you want to continue to follow me in my archaeological adventures, you can follow me on Snapchat or Insta. And of course, you can always find me on Facebook. I'll spell my name out for you guys in the caption. Um, I love what I do. So